Dude. Dude. Hey y'all, Wild Kyle here. Welcome back to the channel. I'm with Ariana, who's behind the camera right now. And we are in Kentucky. We're going to be driving around and doing some road cut hunting, finding fossils from the Ordovician period, which are over 400 million years old when this area was completely underwater, which is insane to imagine now driving around the mountains and hillsides looking for these fossils. So we have potential to find some really cool stuff today. We're going to jump in the truck. We just got some supplies. The most important thing, extra toasty Cheez-Its. I can't wait to eat this entire box in one day. Let's go find some cool stuff. We have not been on the road very long at all. I've devoured over half of the extra toasty Cheez-Its, but that's fine because I'm going to need the energy for all the fossil hunting that we're going to do today. I'm very excited for the types of fossils we're going to be finding today. Potential trilobites, brachiopods, corals, and things like that because these are some of the first types of fossils I ever found as a kid. And I got into this stuff and I would find these types of fossils in my driveway in Michigan. They would have uh, fill dirt put in that was from like limestone mines and things like that. So you'd be able to find cool fossils like that. This is going to be a very good day. We're not very far from the first spot, and we'll get out and find some fossils here very soon. All right, y'all, we are at the first road cut, and as you can see, there's some beautiful rocks out there, which means lots of fossils, but before we get out and start looking for fossils, I wrote a song for the fossil gods, hopefully to please them. Oh my gosh. Well, that's endless rocks to look at. Y'all know that makes me very happy. Pretty plants too. There's gonna be a lot of fossils right there. Uh, oh my God, they're everywhere already. Look at, that's a crazy brachiopod geode. Ah, that's a crazy brachiopod geode. Oh my gosh. Dude, look at the crystals in that. It's huge. It's so beautiful. I don't understand y'all. It's it's literally endless brachiopods. I mean, endless. And they're big. They're all big and they're beautiful. Oh my gosh, there's so many. I've never seen so many in my life. Look at that one. That's so beautiful. Oh, the preservation is insane on these. Is that a little gastropod piece? Maybe. I cannot believe the preservation on these brachiopods. This is so cool. Oh, that one is giant. Is that a big one? Oh my. Oh, that's a couple combined, but that one's huge. What the heck? Oh, look at that. That is a monster. What the heck, dude? How's that big boy hide down there? Oh my gosh. They are large. Oh, that piece just popped right off. That was nice. Oh, I, I can't, you can't move because there's too many. Oh, there's just like, if you move, oh, whoa, look at that species. That's a different one. I don't know my brachiopod names from the Ordovician very well. Look at this stuff. How is this real? These are huge. They're, oh my God. There's more than you could ever want. That, what a good problem to have. Holy crap. All right, let's find some more geode ones. What's that one right there? That looks nice. Oh, that one's got some crystal in it, but it's not hollow. What do you think, Ariana? Did the song work? I think the song definitely worked. <laughs> I think the song worked. It summoned all these brachiopods. Oh, check that out. That's a cephalopod chunk. That's awesome. Mollusk squid-like creature from the Ordovician. That's a cool piece right there. Didn't quite expect it, but here it is. And I really like this little matrix piece right there. Look at that brachiopod. Just sitting there perfectly. I like that a lot. Look at the huge flat brachiopod impressions in the rock right there. It's in a giant slab. That is incredible. There's one down there. Not both sides, a little broken up. You can definitely be selective here if you want. Look at that. 
That is massive. We're going to be able to cut some of these open too and see if there's crystals on the inside of them. That's going to be really fun. It's like that first one I found with the crazy crystals. There might be those not broken open yet. Look at this one. I just grabbed it and it was cracked and I ripped it open and there's crazy crystals inside of it. What? That is beautiful. Look at that big beautiful one right there. Golly. That thing is huge. That one feels light for its size. I bet there's crystals inside that thing. Oh, wow. Look at that plate. <laughs> Ariana said it's finally sunny. <laughs> yeah, we've had uh, some cloudy days. Look at this piece. Giant brachiopods in the rock. That is amazing. Oh, hey, little buddies. Who's that big in right there? Jesus, what? Well, that one feels light, too. <laughs> There's probably crystals inside it. Oh my gosh. I see another cephalopod chunk. Very cool little fossil. I love these things. That is really cool there. Look at that. There's a, like a little plate. The brachiopod broke open. And there's beautiful crystals on the inside of it. Look at that. That is awesome. Look at that big boy. Jesus. That is a massive brachiopod. I cannot handle how many amazing gigantic brachiopods there are. I cannot handle it. It is overwhelming to my brain in the best way ever. Oh my gosh. Y'all don't understand. Hello there. Oh! <laughs> this is unreal. I don't know, man. I'm, this is crazy. Oh, there's a different one. Different type. I like that one, too. I like all of them. Hello there. These are so big. I am speechless. Oh, wow, look at that. Look at that one in the rock. It's giant. Oh my gosh. You've got to be kidding. Oh my god. Look at the crystals inside that. That is one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen in my life. Are you kidding me? Oh, dude. I just want to take a look at this brachiopod and ask everyone on my channel why in the world do I not live in Kentucky right now? Because this is a dream. Oh nice! Look at that cephalopod that Ariana got. Way out here. Away from the cut. That's awesome. What the heck is that crystal growth in that one? That's different. It's different than like the, cal is it calcite growing these I think? That one is so cool. I gotta keep this one safe. I heard Ariana go, ooh. My, oh my, oh. No. Look at this one that Ariana found. That's the most insane one I've seen yet. That is crazy. Wow. This one's got two brachiopods that are both geodes. Oh! Oh my god. Oh, they're friends. They're buddies and they're both it's crystal us. buddies. It's us. It's us as brachiopods. This is us. Look at look at that. That's that's you and I as brachiopods with the craziest cool crystals ever. Oh my gosh. I see a very nice geode one. Oh whoa. There's some very weird crystals going on in that one. That is very, very cool and very different. Look at that. That's so neat. Look how big. Oh, wow. It feels light too. Probably crystals in it. Look how large and in charge that one is. Oh, wow. It's in Matrix still. I wonder if the Matrix will just pop right off. There we go.
Jeez, look at that thing. That is insanely beautiful. I climbed up high here on this way down there now, and I'm up here looking at this layer of just brachiopods eroding out everywhere. Look at that. They're everywhere up here. Oh, there's a huge one in the matrix still a little bit, but a huge one. This is really cool. I got this little one right here. There's a crack in it, and I think I might be able to just pop it open with my hand. Oh, wow. Yeah. Look at that. That's cool. I might just have to maybe cut a slight edge off that one to see into it a little better, but that's a geode brachiopod right there. Awesome. Awesome. Ariana just picked up this little guy right there, just completely full of crystals. Look how beautiful that is. Brachiopod that side, crystals that side. Very nice. Look at this handful that Ariana has. It, with, that was in like two seconds. She's like, pluck, 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 like just They're picking everywhere. them up. Look at that geode right there, brachypod geode. Wow. That's gorgeous. A little sand in there, gonna have to wash out. Excited to see that. This little guy right here is cool. Look at that, crystals on there. That is awesome. Got a big one right there. Oh, almost had both sides. Do any of y'all know the name of this plant? Let me know in the comments below. Is it it's, honeysuckle? Is it honeysuckle? It smells very, very nice. It's very beautiful. I like this one right here. That's kind of a species I hadn't wow. seen a whole lot of out here. Very, very nice. Very well preserved. Awesome fossil. It's also important to check down low, away from the sloping road cut, because there's huge brachiopods like that, and beautiful smaller ones such as that. You can literally just hunker down in a spot right here. Pick a one up, pick a one up, pick one up, pick one up. It is incredibly endless. I saw crystals staring at me, look at that, wow. That's very gorgeous from a big round brachiopod. I bet that one's got crystals in it too. There's a huge one next to it. I think I'm gonna take that piece and cut this, cut into this one. See if I can get a double little piece right there. Check out this very gorgeous cephalopod that Ariana just found. That's a very nice chunk of one. Sweet. That is too nice. Dang, he's so good at hiding. What is that thing? Look at it, y'all. Weird little creature. This is pretty cool. Up at the top here, there's these plates with uh, corals, and I don't know if you see all that red movement, those weird little bugs crawling around all over this stuff. They must like the heat from these rocks getting baked in the sun. But yeah, look at some of those plates, just with brachypod chunks and whatnot. Very cool. I love seeing the big ones sitting in the rock like that. Oh, that one's actually loose. <laughs> That's crazy. Just like you're plucking it from the 400 million year old ocean floor. Take a look at that geode brachiopod. Oh my goodness, look at those crystals. That is so beautiful. I see beautiful crystals on that one. Look at that. Oh, that is incredible. I absolutely love these. Look at the big crystals on that one. Those are incredibly stunning. How about this piece that Ariana just picked up, y'all? Look at that, two brachiopods, some weird crystal growth in that one. What a cool piece. We got some more cephalopod, let's go. That's sweet, it's like the tip of one or something. I don't know how it works, <laughs> that's cool. I see a trilo butt, you see it? Check it out right there. That is so cool. First one of the day, hopefully there's more to come. And also right below it, 
a brachiopod geode in some rock. Look at those crystals. How about that geode one right there? Oh man. Beautiful little crystals. I see one. I see two. Oh, that one's really cool. And I see three, little guy. Oh. I really like this one. It's weird. It's all got crushed weird or something before it was fossilized. Very neat. That one right there looks super pretty. Look at that. Wow. Looks like a shark mouth teeth. Oh, right that side too. That's cool. Oh, that's awesome. I love that one. How about that little geode? Oh man, those are nice crystals. Oh, I love that. That's beautiful. Just a perfect little display piece the way it is. Don't got a cut or nothing. Oh, y'all. Look at that. Ah, something stabbed me. Would y'all look at that calcite right there? Ariana just spotted this in the wall. We got it wet with water bottle. That's gorgeous, like amber honey calcite. That is so beautiful. Wow. All right, y'all. That was absolutely insane. So good. That was some of the best brachiopod hunting that I've ever done. And there were geodes, and I can't wait to cut some of these open. But now we're going to jump in the truck and move on to the next spot. So let's get to it. So now is going to also be a good time to remind y'all that in the description below there's a link to my newest single. It's a song called This Town is Going to Swallow You Whole. And my album comes out July 21st. Um, it's under Kyle Keller on Spotify or wherever else you stream music. So go check it out. Let me know what y'all think. Thanks. So um, this cut right here is one that we did not even plan on, but we just saw it. And we had to jump out of the truck. We started finding cool stuff. I didn't even have my camera. So I ran back to the truck and grabbed my camera. Ugh. Let me show you what we found. Look at these corals. Look how cool those are. Beautiful. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Ariana just pulled that one out. These are such cool corals. Look at this big one I pulled out a minute ago. Check that out. I just love the way these look. They're crystallized, kind of replaced with silica of some sort or something. It's windy. Sorry if y'all hear a bunch of wind noise, but those are very, very cool corals. This is the first little one I found. Look at the crystal in there. Look at this one. It's so round and cool. Uh-oh. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get it. <laughs> okay, hold on. I'm going to turn the camera off for a second, y'all, and see if I can get it. All right. I was able to get it. <laughs> Look at that thing, it's dude. Double. <laughs> it's so cool. It's a twofer. It's a twofer. Oh, it's so beautiful. Wow, look at that coral. Ah, I cannot wait to get that thing cleaned up. Look how cool that is. Big old coral. I think we're in the Ordovician. I'll have to check the rocked app. Probably is Ordovician, though. <laughs> Whoo, buddy. Y'all, check out that one, that Ariana. Oh, it's such a cool shape. Dude, that is awesome coral. Beautiful. Here's your amazing coral. Thank you. Let's see if I can get this coral. Oh, oh, how big is it? Get out of there. I want you. You need both hands? No. Nice. Oh, oh, <laughs> that's a whole coral. <laughs> oh, God. Dude. Oh, look oh, at all careful, the careful. bugs. I don't, think they're, I don't think they're biting ants, but that's so cool. Beautiful big chunk. Yes. Check this out that Ariana just found. There is pyrite. There's pyrite cubes on that. Look at that. It's beautiful. So we'll be keeping an eye out for iron staining now. That's so gorgeous. Ariana just picked up a really cool cephalopod piece. Check that out. That's beautiful. Look at that big old coral right there. Oh my! Oh, I think it's split in two. Ugh. Yeah, it's split right there. That's kind of sad. That's pretty cool though. Look at that thing. Oh wow, it just keeps going back there. That's more of it. That's insane. Look at that's another piece right there. Wow. That is very cool. Got a little uh, 
Ordovician coral reef happening right here. Wait, where'd that one piece go I saw? Oh, right there. There's a piece. That's the nice or pretty colored one. Oh, that's a cool little guy. That's nice. Let's see what this one looks like. Blech. This one's just broken on one side, but it's big. Look at all that coral polyps on there. I like those. Cutting past you. Cut on past. Sorry. <laughs> This road cut is a little bit hard to walk. It's, it's a little scary. It's steep. Oh, the, I don't like that rock. I'm nope. I'm moving right now. I'm moving. I'm taking my coral and I'm gone. Look at this gastropod in the rock. That's so cool. It's in a massive slab, so I can't take it. But that's beautiful. Check those crystals out, y'all. Little calcite crystals in a pocket. That's beautiful. While I was bending down to look at that, I noticed this coral stuck in the matrix too. That's pretty cool. Check this out, y'all, that Ariana just found. I don't know what that is. It looks like it could possibly possibly be a, some sort of coral, or like maybe is it like a stromatolite of some sort? If any of y'all know, let us know in the comments, because that's something I've never seen before. That's really cool. See you later, beautiful road cut. Thank you for your coral treasures. You have been amazing. On to the next one. Well... This is one of the most insane road cuts I've ever seen in my life. This thing is tall. This is the Maysville road cut. A famous road cut. Apparently you can potentially find rolled trilobites. Things like that here. I'm very excited to take a look. Look at this y'all. We've been here less than five minutes. Ariana found a piece of a trilobite right there. A little trilo butt. That is awesome. And a gastropod on that piece right there too. My brain is overwhelmed at this location due to the amount of rocks to look at. But there are these really cool little, uh, little plates right here. Look at those little tiny brachiopods in there. They're really, really pretty little plates. It's just, there's so much to look at. It's, it's crazy. <laughs> the wild Kyle has located the butt of a trilobite. A partial butt at least right there. That is cool. Let's find a whole one, y'all. We can do it. I like this cut, this very fun little corals everywhere. Like really, just really, really neat little pieces. A lot of delicate little fossils, which are very fun to find in formations that are this old. Really cool, it looks like a crinoid bit running through there maybe. Look at the size of that brachiopod impression. That's insanely huge. There's some really cool pieces right here. Look okay, that's just a slab. Full brachiopods. What a what a beautiful slab. Man, I wonder if like on these undersides there's trilobites and stuff, but you just can't see because they're all covered in mud. So I just gotta flip rocks over and come after it rains and all that stuff. Some cool corals or something on there, Bryce Owens maybe. Oh my god. That is a big chunk of a cephalopod. You can kind of see where it still was going. Oh, that's cool, I gotta keep that. Big giant cephalopod chunk. Man, if only it kept going, but that's still really cool. And there's a brachiopod there. That is awesome. This is kind of funny. Ariana and I have been sending pictures back and forth to each other what we're finding because we're so far away on the cut. <laughs> That's fun. This stuff is absolutely some of the coolest plates I've ever seen of coral and brachiopods and things. Really, really neat. Look at how big some of them are, too. There's my hand on that one. I mean, geez. And there's all this, like, clay stuff with loose stuff. I don't know if you would find trilobites in that or not. That would be kind of cool. Look at that. There's a different shell. Brachiopod there. I mean, really just cool stuff. Ah, oh, man. Nope. 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 That is so cool. No. I have to find a way to get that. I have to find a way to break part of this rock off. Because <laughs> that's crazy. That is a good, amazing cephalopod. Are you kidding me? No. I need, I, I'm going to do it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get my hammer and chisel. I'm going to do it. And that, my friends, 
is a manageable piece. I got it. That is awesome. That is so awesome. I will say, I'm quite in awe at the millions and millions and millions and millions of years that are exposed on this road cut. And the fact that we're finding these fossils in it, we're literally getting a glimpse back in time. And that is as humbling as it gets, my friends. This is kind of interesting here. I, I think I'm starting to be able to learn like what's a piece of a trilobite. And I'm pretty sure like that's a piece of one, that's a piece of one, and that is a piece of one right there too. Um, I know they do a lot of the molting and things like that, so they get scattered around. So I think those are little pieces like that, just in complete fragments. And when you look really close at these plates, you start seeing more of that kind of thing. So they're somewhat abundant, it seems like, but not uh, not intact ones. Intact ones are, are definitely not abundant. That's the that's the trick, I think. Look, you can see them. You can see the little trilobite dudes right there. Right there, right there, little heads of them. Little fragments. Let's find a whole one, I need a whole one. Somewhere. If you come do road cuts, be very, very careful. It's uh, you could very easily slip in this stuff, so I'm definitely not climbing too high up there. Buddy, look at the brachiopods on that slab. Ow! Look how cool they are. Just a huge flat slab of them. Oh, just a bunch of buddies hanging out. They were having a party. A flood came and the party was over. Sorry, y'all. This is wild. Look at all the little corals. Look at all of them. Just falling out of the rock right here because they're all in it. So there's a bunch of loose pieces all over the place. Isn't that wildly cool? Wow. All right, that's gotta be the coolest coral piece I've seen yet. That is so crazy. Look at that all in there. There's a bunch, ah! Look how cool those corals are. I love that. Not many a sight I would prefer to see. Oh, oh it's, no! It's in the rock. I don't know if I can get it. Okay, I'm gonna try. Oh, okay, I got it. I thought it was stuck in a huge rock. It's stuck in just like, not a huge rock. Stops right there. What a beautiful display piece. That is awesome. Wow. Another cephalopod. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Ariana gifted me a sweet gastropod in her cast. It is amazing. She walked over here to the other side, and it is uh, pretty similar stuff. A lot bigger chunks of rock, kind of like at the end of the road cut where I was on the other side. A lot of huge chunks. <laughs> Let's just zoom in and out on it for a few seconds, y'all. Dude, dude. Oh, my. God, I am in love with that cephalopod. Oh, we gotta wash it off. We gotta wash off the other part of it. And hopefully do it without me dying. Oh, oh this water is so weird and gross. Oh, oh. <laughs> so beautiful. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? I am a happy human right now. Oh my gosh. All right, y'all. We are absolutely beat right now. This road cut was absolutely amazing. All the road cuts we stopped at today were amazing. So thanks for going on the adventure with us. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. We'll see you in the next one.